Yo, what's up, everybody? My name is D Flawless, and welcome to another very special episode of Rate My Guardians Drip. Uh, we do this every so often. We really, we kind of do it every day here on the Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash D underscore flawless. Anyway, you come in here, and with channel points, you can submit your guardian into the Guardian Fashion Discord, and we're going to rate it. We're going to give it a rating out of 10, and if you get a perfect 10, you enter the Guardian Fashion Hall of Fame. Very simple, very fun stuff. So to get right into it, we got Jetpack Rabbit. Are we doing a little uh, breast cancer awareness here? Pink is my favorite color. All right, we got the Sunrise Warrior. Holy smokes, Jetpack. I'm blinded by the pink. All right, let's talk about it. And right away, we see one, two, three, four Sunrise Warriors and one Irradiant Charoit. Charoit. This is a very pink Titan. So it's for a good cause. Submit a pink Guardian. We're not going to beat in the point of single shaders too much. What's the plan here, Jetpack? <laughs> What's, what are we going for? What do you want me to feel with this Titan? I feel like there's a lot of things going on here. What did you want me to feel with this helmet choice? It's pink, but I'm also going to die. <laughs> Fashion wise, I gotta be honest, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not really excited about this one. I'm sorry. We gotta give it a five. Nice looking Titan. Just not quite what we're looking for for fashion. Next up, we got Astronomical. Whoa, I feel like I'm in danger. <laughs> Someone has hired a cyborg robot alien monster to track me down and this is it. This guy's coming to get you. Is this Attack on Titan? Okay, don't don't take my anime card chat, but I've never actually watched Attack on Titan. <laughs> but I, I've seen the pictures and I know it's the Colossal Titan. Now, here's the thing. You can nail a theme. You can nail a cosplay, but that doesn't mean that it's fashionable. This looks good. It, like in terms of cosplay and a theme, this looks amazing. I, it, but I gotta be honest. I don't, I don't know how fashionable it is. So this is what we're comparing it to. And I think you nailed it, but we're not gonna see this guy walking down any runways anytime soon. There is a little bit of that kind of like derelict chic look going on here. I think a fair score for this would be a seven. I think seven is fair. All right. Some effort was put in. You nailed the theme. You nailed the cosplay. It's not exactly high fashion, but I can see somebody wanting to rock this. All right. Next up, we got Brad's bum bum. What am I looking at here? <laughs> what, what's happening? What is this? I can't look away, but yet I want to. I love it and hate it at the same time. I simultaneously love it with all my heart and hate it with the intensity of a thousand suns. It's so cute yet so hideous. What? <laughs> What is happening? You do get props for using Shinobu's Vow. I think if you're late on your protection payments, this guy's gonna come looking for you. You can't tell me this hunter doesn't talk with a lisp. Yeah, so listen, I was fighting Savathun, right? I said, Savathun, baby, you better quit playing with me before I throw a skip grenade at you. So I did what I had to do. I hit it with the Raiden Flux, baby. <laughs> what? Is Brad, what is this? She said, one skip ain't enough. I said, I got, I got Shinobu's Vow, honey. Have another one. <laughs> Chat, this is either a two or a 10. <laughs> Look at the sparrow. This is a hunter named Slickback. <laughs> you better have his money on time. For the sheer entertainment value of this, I gotta give this an eight. This is an eight out of 10. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I <th> <laughs> it's good job. You made me feel something. It, it was an uncomfortable feeling, but you made me feel nonetheless. All right, next up, Shawoom. This is like if Voltron, Megazord, and Odin had a baby. It would be this Titan. There's so much happening here. I and it, and it doesn't necessarily look bad. It doesn't necessarily look bad. This is me just hanging out in the tower. It's a good shot. It's a good shot. That's This is a really great screenshot red beer props on this screenshot dude this isn't a picture competition it's a fashion competition back view oh look at that stance look at that posture amazing posture here suros brought to you by suros it's very majestic and you have to do this with your hand every time you say majestic <laughs> this is if brock lesnar was a guardian <laughs> ladies and gentlemen my name is d flawless and I am the advocate for the reigning, defending, undisputed, heavyweight champion of the world, Brock Lesnar. He got that stealing, stealing wives and crushing skulls look. It's a good looking Titan chat. Let's, all right, let's, let's get serious here for a second. Like, as funny, it's it's just big, right? That's what she said. But anyway, chat, 
grow up. So once you get over the size of it, I gotta, I, I can't stop. It's just happening automatically. Now. Once you get over the size of it, it's a good looking Titan. It works. Everything works here. The colors match. The glows are nice. This man eats shoulders for breakfast. <laughs> Even from behind, it looks great. Seven, it's too wide. It's a Titan. You can't, you can't take away points for a Titan being wide. That's like taking away points for water for being wet. It's a Titan. It's going to be wide. I don't like this Ferrari. It's too fast. Ah, uh, but let's talk about why you're only getting 85 FPS in the appearance tab, Redbeard. I mean, that's the real conversation that needs to be had. Sounds like you need a PC from Power GPU. Use code flawless. Ah, do we give this a 10 chat? Takes a lot to render those shoulders. <laughs> But for whatever reason, there is something that is putting me off and I can't quite put my finger on it because I don't feel confident in the 10. We're going nine. Yeah, it's a nine. It's a nine. Which brings us to our three time champion. Theo, this is the drip of a three time champion. Does he have enough to take home the four time crown? Theo brings the heat every time, chat. He brings the heat every time. Here's the back view. I like the use of red and blue. I like the contrasting colors. That's a that's a good call, Teal. Teal's got a very good fashion eye, y'all. We got the blue and the white, which kind of play together. Like, this is what I mean when I say I'm looking for pops of color. We got the red popping off the blue. What an excellent contrast, red to blue. And then you see it all throughout here. So he's got it here on the, on the arms and then here. As good as this looks, is it enough? to enter him into the Hall of Fame for a fourth time. We gotta give this an eight. Because I do agree, I think the Titan we had before this looked looked a little bit better than this. Congratulations, Steel, another amazing submission, sir. Not quite Hall of Fame worthy. Uh, you're gonna have to work for that fourth one. You're gonna have to work for that fourth crown. All right, next up, we got Chicken Bottom with the Elven Warlock. And right away, another one that's just like, oh! It's so bright, but that's not a bad thing. We're just having fun. I got to tell you, Chicken Bottom, I'm kind of digging this Warlock, dude. It's very clean. It's very sleek. No exotics, but that's not required. I just think it's cool if you could throw in an exotic. I, you know, you guys know I love royal colors. I love the gold. The helmet's nice. We have some effects coming off the helmet here. This is sleek, dude. He's even got the pointy toes with the boots for an elvish look. Little safe. Oh, come on. Y you know, safe Safe is safe. But when it, if it's fashion, there's a reason these, these models are walking down runways in white and black. All right you know, at these big fashion events. Yeah, every now and then they throw out a weird color, but you know, white and black are always gonna hit, so you can't take away points because he's using white and gold. Jeez, I thought I was harsh. I thought I was nitpicky. I would rock this look. Are we just hating chat? Take a look inside yourself and ask yourself, am I hating right now? I think sometimes simplicity is a complexity all its own, hashtag bars. For me, you don't have to agree, chat. For me, I gotta give it a 10. Congratulations. Congratulations, Chicken Bottom. You have made it into the Guardian Fashion Hall of Fame. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna bring this segment to a close. We had six Guardians submit their fashion, and we even had a champion. Congratulations once again to Chicken Bottom. If you like the video, please leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the submissions today. And if you want to try your hand at getting into the Guardian Fashion Hall of Fame, be sure to stop by the Twitch channel when we're live, twitch.tv slash D underscore flawless. Make sure you're following the channel. Type exclamation point drip in chat and see if you have what it takes to enter the Hall of Fame. Till next time, peace out.